Hi, Adal. How was the show? Live one. Live Dork Forest live in Bridgetown Dork Comedy Forest. Festival. Nice. Portland, Oregon. It was amazing, quite honestly. First of all, the highest attendance. Oh, really? Of any live Dork Forest. Really? Do you get 25 people there? <laughs> no, I think I've had as many as like 60 or 80 at LA Podfest. Oh, nice. Bridgetown, there were over 150 people there. Well, that look at amazing. you. Look at you climbing the, the climbing ladder. Climbing the ladder of live Dork Forest attendance. More people should go see your live Dork Forest shows because they're really fun. It is fun, It's uh, but it was part of the fest. It was a panel pod, and it was with Guy Branham. Friends oh, of the show. Friend of the show. Guy Branham, nice guy. Canadian dork. Canadian dork. Canadian politics dork. Uh, Karen Gilgariff, who uh, was Sandra of, Bullock dork. Friend of the show also. Friend of the show. Did an episode on Sandra Bullock. Oh, right. And um, Didn't she also... She also did a previous live episode from the LA Podcast Festival with Dave Anthony. That's right. And talked about salads. <laughs> and salads came up again, <laughs> this particular... Well, she might be a dork about salads. She's dorky about salads. She loves a salad. And then Amber Preston. Amber oh. Preston came from Minneapolis. Right. And uh, she's the new kids on the block dork. <laughs> but here's the thing about a panel, the new panel, the new theory with the live dorkdoms, and it's a panel of comedians. Mm -hmm. The first person to send me their dorkdoms... To that's, everybody's dorkdom. That's what we're talking about. That's what we're talking that's the, about. That's the, Find that's the a way to like at it. Hand. Yes. And otherwise, you just got to blast through with your dorkdom once you get there. Right, which is we found time to talk salads and new kids on the block. Oh, good. But let me tell you, we talked about um, feminism. This was These were Guy Branham's. He was the Canadian first Canadian feminism? No, American, <laughs> U.S. <laughs> and we talked about menstruation. Oh. He was fascinated. <laughs> 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 it was feminism, romantic comedies, and Passover. Made me laugh, the Passover. and uh, Where did menstruation fit into those? Feminism. Oh, okay. Romantic well, that's comedies. That's for the best. That's going to ruin a romantic comedy if somebody's on their, on, on their period. Right. And it'll certainly get I the almost said, on the rag. Charming. Charming, <laughs> Jackie. You kiss your mom with that mouth? Nope. She's dead. <laughs> anyway, so uh, <laughs> the... Uh, <laughs> But then, but then, uh, romantic comedies, and then Passover. He has the biggest Passover. He he has a production, a Passover production. Oh, really? And everyone is given a script. Oh, right, sure. And it's, so it's it's got to be a musical. Uh, I Passover believe has to be a musical. Music is involved, but what he's hoping for is to hire someone to do lighting next year. But he cooks everything, and uh, sometimes sure. there's a Mexican theme to the to the food. Sometimes there's not. Okay. But I'm like, because I all I said was brisket, right? And he was like. Don't be ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> what did he serve? Uh, this particular, it was some sort of, I believe it was beef. I hope it wasn't pork. And because um, I think it's not supposed to be. I don't think it's supposed to be. Pretty pork. sure. I think, uh, I think, uh, I think somebody got a spear in the side to prevent <laughs> us from eating pork or something. Right. Or we were allowed to eat pork because he took a, he took a bullet. Right. Took a spear to the side. That's right. Oh, that's it. That was I it. Get a, I get that mixed up all the time. You, you get your religions mixed up I all do. the time. <laughs> and he's pro-halal, though. That's the good news about him. <laughs> but it was a great episode, a great live episode. And um, that's going to be the first one I think I put on Bandcamp to help pay for the sound guy. Oh, fun. Yeah. So it'll just be two bucks, unless you're a super fan. Two bucks. Two Two bucks. Two bucks, or and you won't be listening to this. You could be listening to this because I I don't know where else to put this. I suppose I could put it also on Bandcamp. <laughs> well, it's the it's the <laughs> it's the phone bonus for the episode for the episode. <laughs> so it's going to go on Bandcamp, right? I guess if that's where the episode's going, <laughs> you are correct. That's where this should go. <laughs> Thanks for listening, folks. Thanks for finding us on Bandcamp. <laughs>